Well, how do the pros race so much faster than weekend warriors like me? The secret is to train at speed, and here's how they do it. I was very fortunate to be in the first Australian team to go away to race in Europe and we did the Women's Tour de France in 86, 87 and 88 and we did the exact same stages as the men or on the same day, the same place, except for we did about half the distance. Cycle Edge is a coaching business that I started 12 years ago and it's to allow anybody who loves a bike to come in in a safe environment and test themselves on the bikes. We run um, ergo sessions one hour at a time. We run about 12 sessions a week and people come in, they work to their own level. There's a fair bit of chatting that goes on in between efforts because all of the sessions are structured around intervals. They form social groups. We go out riding on the road and, and actually have formed some great friendships. But the underlying theme through it all is to push yourself physically, to challenge yourself and help you to get fitter. There's a large variety of people that come through Cycle Edge. We have riders who've represented Australia who go to Olympics, down to people who don't ever aspire to race. They just want to keep fit. And they mix. It's not separate classes. Oftentimes they will mix in. Motor pacing is for a variety of reasons. We motor pace for leg speed. For example, when we had the era with athletes coming through for talent transfer, not being familiar with the pedaling action, we use motor pacing to get the motor patterns happening quickly. We use it for high heart rate work, if you keep pace up when you're going uphill. So a variety of things. Cycling in Australia in the last two decades, the, the biggest change is actually the state of the roads and traffic. It is much more dangerous these days. There are so many more cars on the road and there are so many more bike riders and it is yet to be a friendly alliance. In terms of racing, it's much more professional. There's more races, there are bigger fields. Um, it's come a long way.